In the previous section of the Node Operator Manual walkthrough, we created an Ethereum account. In this section, we're going to import that account into MetaMask so that we can stake QSB tokens in the future and become eligible as a Node Operator. To access this section of the Node Operator walkthrough, please look at the links in the description. Once you get here, the first step will be to download MetaMask if you haven't done so already. So open this link. And here you'll see MetaMask, which allows you to make Ethereum transactions directly from your browser. You can choose to get the extension either from Chrome or the Brave browser. I have Chrome, so I'll be going over here. Now I have already downloaded it, so I don't have to do this step. So if you haven't, make sure to do that and you'll know you did it successfully if a little fox appears up here in the corner. So now I'm gonna click on the fox. So now in order to import a new account, I need to go here in the circle, go down to import account. I'm going to select JSON file. I'm gonna choose the file that we created in the previous section. And then I'm gonna enter our password. And this is the same password that you use to create it on myetherwallet.com. Again, we described that in the previous section. So here we go. I successfully imported the account, but let's do a couple more things to get more organized. I'm going to go to account details. And here I'm gonna rename the account again. As you can see, I have lots of different accounts on my MetaMask. I wanna easily locate this in the future. So I'm gonna call it QSP node operator. Awesome. So for the next step, I also want MetaMask to recognize the QSP token. So first I'll come over here. This link can be found in the description of this video. It will take you here. You will find the QSP token. Go over here to contract. This is the contract address. I successfully copied it. I'm going to go back into MetaMask menu. Down here, I'll click on add token, custom token. And here I just paste what I copied. And here you can see it's recognizing that this is my balance in QSP tokens. And now to verify that I did this correctly, I go to menu once again and you can see that I have a little bit of ETH in there and then a little bit of QSP tokens. Also, the current minimum amount that you need to stake in order to be eligible to operate a node is 50,000 QSP. Thank you very much. That's the end for this video. In our next video, we're going to use Etherscan and MetaMask to stake.